Yes. You gotta get nasty. They were actually setting up the same B attack where Hobbit comes in first, entering off a short. Now they have to improvise a bit, but all the pieces are in place. JDC to the left side of Graffiti. Inter is going to plant that bomb with a nade destined for him. Ooh, the second finds its home. Frozen chucks two and gets them both, then boosts. So man advantage here in the hands of Mao as they try to press forward. It's a gush. That's certainly not going to help Frozen. So Torzi, maybe it's on him. But Axiles found his hands onto a beautiful pair of Berettas, presses outwards, wow. finishes off Frozen, slides back into the short side, confirms both CTs, continues to tear up their HP, and Axile is simply better with Ooh. those guns. But Torzi, it's a... By the way, if JDC side holds. Torzi's going to give cover here to Dexter, who leans in. Exertion just got rocked by the Desert Eagle. And Torzi now awaits the pop over top. Yeah, he's reading it. <laughs> oh, they waited too long to come around the corner, so he sees it big picture. And already starts to claim some kills on this AWP. If there was ever a time okay. for this sniper to come online and to do it early, its mappings would just go swimmingly. Would be a dangerous, dangerous idea. Nice forward position here for Maus. I love everything about it. But the timing, that, well, nearly didn't work out. Exertion still gets the better end of it. A little bit more damage done. Frozen slides out. Woo! And it's two clean headshots. But Napany, oh, he's been spotted. And he just got taken down to 19 HP. Won't be able to find the upgrade, you'd think. But still, with that flash, now has hands on the M4. Three bullets. Three bullets. Needs the reload. And knows it. A flash and a desperation jumps across, and now he's going to get pressed in from short. Again, the bullets are simply not here. You cannot kill two players with three shots. And so Dexter finishes him off to give Maus that 5-0 CT. Into shenanigans. He's going to hear this moving back. Yeah. Oh, Frozen. They're looking. They only finds one. But that's a ton of information, bomb included. And you'd think maybe Axile could actually just put pedal to the metal, sprint this into the B site. Obviously cautious because they just don't know, but they that timing was there for the taking. Yeah, and now they have to create a new one, right? If they go too fast here, it's way too obvious two CTs will be in place. If they wait a long time, well, they might have not enough time to... Oh my god, comfortably. And they were just walking out talk onto about, this site. There's two on short. Balls. They're actually being held into this by Hobbit as well. One, but not the second. <gasps> now Exertion also back turned, so Hobbit pieces it together. There we go. For a second, if Exertion had just kept watching Connector, then he's going to come. I mean, they'll happily go 4v4 right now. It's a clean refrag with tempo. But this position from Dexter, it's Big tricky. Chance. Nicely done. Woo. Double off of Frozen's flash. Dexter locks this in. And poor Shiro turned away because it's only two HP left over. Axiles Galil with too many targets. Tries his hand at all three. Comes up with nothing. And Shiro will limp away with the AWP. He's already being hunted. This is a clean sweep of the Cloud9 players. Maus continue a rock solid really make this a meal for Mouse Sports. Going to force Mouse to get a little creative in this, seeing as they're working with the lesser weapons, seeing as utilities nigh non-existent. Oh, it's the, fr the Fury of Crawl. But Frozen has that kit. Keep, you know, it's like it's bare bones, but it's a miraculous moment, maybe. Torzi, he's got more where that first one came from, but Inters keeps it clean. No flank. Hobbit at the forefront, two USPs, of course as Frozen tries to scramble inwards, and Hobbit's gonna stuff Exertion in an instant. USP down for the count, bomb planted, Shiro finds Frozen, and JDC. They'll look for some info back. They get short water, but they've they've come up to help. the A site. Are they late? Let's see, Torzi up to the plate. Sees the util, nice freebie versus Inters, and gets back around the truck. Axile can't keep it clean enough, an excellently timed flank here from Dexter. So Shiro's chance to clutch because three separate fronts all fall the way of Maus. And with 20 seconds on this clock, Shiro doesn't want to go home empty-handed. He's going to press in. Dies immediately to Torzi. What goes around comes in since he does have some space. Tries to press forward. Again, enters. Minimal amounts of kill. 
but it's a good one. It gets back man advantage, presses them closer towards B, opens it as a possibility, and the off goes oh. back. Shiro can sense you, and Dexter dives into the short side, picks up two kills, pistol out, and Inters will bring this back. It gets into JDC V2, and if he finds that timing, well, he would have found them by surprise. Instead, Hobbit closes, and Cloud9 take double digits as they kick off what could be a rush for Mao's up through bathrooms, now no longer wasting time. Axile locking horns down long. Napani inside the bomb site kills Dexter on the other end. Three kills back in from Mouse. If there's one thing that goes their way, it seems to always be pistols. The bomb is left here at long. They're taking over a bank control. The CTs are Ooh. trying to be patient, but they're being hunted from the back. Nice. Torsi gets that. Little fight forward. Hobbit smoked off for a moment, trying to do it all on his own. And he just gets lost inside of that smoke, so he has to peel away from it. Mouse will find the post plant. Frozen on 70, Exertion on 40. And Hobbit, who looked world class in Inferno, is now hunting a one versus three. As he slides out, he's got one pinned against the truck. It's a little dance versus Torzi that Hobbit's come out on top of. And he's still got that 100 health. Wouldn't this be a miracle? Yeah, he'll get caught on the cross. Now, with such little HP, it goes down nice and smooth. Bot would have to start its long journey now. Oh, man. Cloud9. They can try to wait for the walkthrough to the site. The T's are yep. actually going to think yep. about going back. 30 seconds, Hobbit. and they might run into this. Hobbit is the one chosen for this moment. He keeps it tucked beneath the ledge and goes down empty-handed. They needed that. It opens up the rotation for the bomb. Frozen's already deep, and Cloud9 will now desperately start to run this back over. Oh, what? JDC just slams a shot through smoke. Axile comes through, dropped by Frozen, who slid past the dead body of Dexter. Keep Axile alive and standing, and will give Cloud9 a little sigh of relief. Torzi gets the better of it. But that's going to prime Hobbit for a one-tap flank. Oh, and and he just instantly transmissions back down into connector. But not ready for Frozen to come through. Uh, Singular man advantage. The multifaceted lurks once again here for Mouse Sports. Finding an interesting way back into the round. 2v4 is unthinkable. 2v3, well, it's improbable, but... Mouse still with money, still with HP. It's good utility. Oh, oh missed flag. flash. JDC gonna have to work in without it. Shiro comes up from dumpster, but misses his one shot. Did he not see his hands? I don't hands? know if he did. Napani was exposed, and now he goes left, wide, and to the surprise. No utilities. Maxile. Ooh, dinked. Makes things a little more interesting, but that's just one M4, and it comes at a cost. Grenade's gonna chip away. Napani sliding. How do they fit in that corner? Two dudes. One spot had a chance now from Frozen. 21 and 9. I don't need to remind you of what he's capable of doing when he puts up numbers like that, but of course, it's That's that black bars, baby. He's playing that game right back and forth, left and right, which way to look. And now all of a sudden, Mao's, they're gonna crank that dial to a 10. Dexter goes running through. Stuffed by Inters up close. More flashes, both sides. Frozen prevails. Hobbit slides in, drops bomb, and then gets back around into the corner. Low HP, Shiro shaves off JDC. And Cloud9 look as though they're hanging on again. But how about Frozen? Nope, oh. not this time. It's Exertion over the top, and Exertion goes down Jeez. at the nade of Nap. Shut our mouths about Torzi. 20 and 14. And Frozen now. Let that be your fire. Let that be your fuel. Inters out. Nafani offers one, and with it, Mao's decide to pump the brakes and double back because they've got Exertion pressing towards A. Who's ahead of it? It's Axile. Meant to be the star rifle of Cloud9. His struggles in Rio have been apparent, but he saw that barrel, and he'll shut down Exertion. Next up is Dexter and Torzi, and he's got a smoke to work with. They're gonna hone in on this side, dodges the flash, Axile delivers yet another, but Torzi nails another two. Couple kills left for the Hungarian, looking to feast on this A site. Bomb planted, what a round for him. Nafani presses wide, Torzi dodges and doesn't manage Ooh. another. Pressing into A. Yep. They're now, setting up a lurk. With Frozen over towards Monster, I mean Hobbit on an aisle. Picks up the first one and again. Able to just 
Let's lock in connector, but there's Frozen. A chance to activate Exertion. He's gonna keep him busy up at eight. Damage into Axile. More, in fact, on Shiro. And an open B site, so it seems. There's another piece here. There's another in the water. Nafani fully healthed. Frozen barely standing, and Dexter strikes him down. Dexter now the only one with full HP. A mistimed unscope. Is he gonna do it again to push Mouse to map three? Shiro pistol out. And 